So this question starts off by providing us with a system of equations. We have s plus 7r equals 27. We also have r equals 3, right? So it's not really so much a system of equations because although r equals 3 is technically an equation, it's also just telling us what the r value is, right? So if I look at my answer choices, for instance, uh, well, let's, let's not skip over the question. So the question says, what is the solution, r, s, to the given system of equations? Well, that means we're asking, well, what is r? And what is s? Well, the question tells me what r is, right? It tells me that r is 3, which means choice A, which in which case they're saying r is 6, cannot be correct. Choice D, where it says r is 27, can also not be correct, right? So we have a 50-50 just based upon understanding what was given to us. Next thing I can do is take this r equals 3 and plug it into the first equation. So the first equation says s plus 7r equals 27. Again, because I know that r is 3, I just replace r with 3. And I simplify this or solve for s. So this becomes s plus 21 equals 27. Subtracting 21 from both sides of the equation gives me s is equal to 6. And therefore, I know that s is 6 when r is 3, which means that choice B, right, where r is 3 and s is 6, has to be the correct answer.